used to vote Republican until FDR got elected, and he began to see what they wanted to do for the common people, and he changed his politics. And my dad said that Roosevelt was fluent enough to the special interests, and the big money couldn't control him. And John Edwards seems to be the only one people running today that I believe that can equal that. You think about great American presidents who brought about real change. There are people like Teddy Roosevelt, who busted the trust, broke up the monopolies, stood up for the American people. <laughs> Franklin Roosevelt, in many ways, did the same thing. This is a great transformational president. But what people have forgotten about Franklin Roosevelt is that he was absolutely vilified by big corporate America. They hated him. And he used to say that he welcomed their hatred. Because what it meant was he was doing what was right. He wasn't making a deal with these people. He was fighting and standing up for the American people. And then along came Harry Truman. And you all heard the Harry Truman story. You know, somebody said to Harry Truman, you're giving him hell, Harry. And he said, no, you just tell him the truth and it feels like hell. <laughs> well, we're going to tell the truth. That's what we're going to do. And the truth is that corporate greed is stealing your children's future, just as sure as I'm standing here. And we need to be as direct and honest about that as we can because you have to identify the problem before you can fight to change it. I hope that John Edwards is our modern-day FDR.